Hello YouTube, this is Dakota from Botan Media, and today we've got another reaction to a new track. It is Nero's Too Many Questions, the fourth single from their forthcoming record. Uh, they're kind of come back to it at this point. I have been, uh, I would say, a fan of the first couple tracks that have come out. Truth, Blame You, Draw Energy. Uh, I've been digging them. I've been jamming with them. And uh, this is another one. Obviously, this is the fourth single, and I am ready to get down with it and see what we think of the track. This is my first time listening to this. I haven't even seen online discourse about these tracks at all. So uh, without any further ado, let's hop into it. This is Nero, Too Many Questions. This is very fun for Nero. This is this is unique. Sometimes I wait for your call, your confessions. I don't want to miss you at all. Okay, are we staying with Garage? We're not doing a DNB finale? I kind of thought it was, that's where we're going. That's kind of a hard shift. one Nero too many questions uh, not at all what I thought we were getting into when we got into that uh, track uh, it is a like funky garage style track that is to my knowledge not that um, Nero's ever done I'm trying to think back to their discography I don't think there's any track of theirs that really is like, that is this sound, uh, that is this style. Um, I, I, there's not actually much I've heard at all that has this very, uh, like, these filtered sustains all throughout are the melody, and it's so fascinating. You've got that backing um, garage-style track beat, uh, the simple, like, percussion instrumentation uh, on the choruses and drops in. But then, obviously, you've got your vocal chops there, or not vocal, you just like your vocals. Um, but then this, like, like, it's just like there's just a sustain that's just there, like, making a constant noise. It's just like... But then they're turning the like the high pass, low pass filter, just like like they're like they're constantly just like playing with it um, as as it's as it's going, and it's a really fun sound, and it's it's fascinating how. Um, it is it it is simple. It is in practice. That is like a pretty simple uh, track to execute, um, but to really make it sound the way that it did and keep it clean and keep it sounding professional and keep the quality up and and make it interesting is the the real feat of this track. And I think they managed to do that quite a bit. Um, I don't think this is my favorite narrow track out there, and I think there's some better songs, uh, better singles so far. But this is definitely like a real um, like a just a real great. I don't even know, like, I don't want to say like a side quest of sort style track, but uh, one that I think in a track that's depending on where it is placed, uh, a really good breath of fresh air for, um, yeah, a track list that may be dominated by a lot of DNB drum step kind of bro step stuff. Uh, and so we'll see where it lands in, in that sense. This would be a great kind of middle respite, but still single style track um, on a track list. And, and so, yeah, I just feel like as, as I'm seeing some of the singles come out, I can see how this thing's being built. And I'm really anticipatory for what this final record is going to be because because um, with songs like this, I feel like there's a lot more variety they can go this way. Um, I feel like we're going to see potentially a record that has a lot more 
to it than just your kind of standard, what we've, um, I, I would say, come to know and love from Nero of the past. But uh, that's a little bit more, uh, yeah, atypical uh, in a good way, uh, in a good way. It's a little more exploratory and out there uh, than what I think a lot of us would originally have anticipated for a Nero record, a new Nero record. So, um, but yeah, I, I really enjoyed the track. I think it's quite fun. I think it's it's funky. I think it's groovy. I think I love, actually, I know I love the garage style to it. Um, that is a bit of a mix up, but uh, yeah, I'd love to hear what you guys have to say in the comment section below, any and all comments right there. But uh, other than that, I'm Dakota from Bowtie Media, and I'll see you guys in another video. Mm -hmm.